everybody, Deb here again. I'm here to bring you two pocket letters today for my two cute um, and lovely granddaughters. One is four years old and one is 12 years old, but they're both getting similar pocket letters just with a little bit different things in them. So anyway, let me get started. The first one is going to be for the four-year-old, and I did it with um, her initials. Haley is her name, and just lots of, um, her favorite color is apparently purple and aqua, so she got more purpley and pink tones, sorry for the glare, and just a little shaker thing I bought somewhere, I think Target or the Dollar Tree, I can't remember. She got the purple bling around the edges. And then they both have, uh, I thought these were those hearts with the paper. When you open them up, they stick together, but they're not. They're just dimensional little um, flip, flippy hearts like that. And then instead of my usual blingy thing, I just gave them a little bag. I also found a Target with their first initial on and a little tassel, cloth tassel. And they each got two pencils and then some little goodies in the bag that I couldn't fit in the pocket. And then um, on the back, um, <laughs> yeah, that's a gift card. Not a big one, but something small they can enjoy. And then I found these little Shopkins stickers and tattoo packs. So I stuck some of them in. And an eraser. Oh, and this... this um, thing sticking up is a 3D, uh, you can't tell it on camera, but it, it's like, the picture changes, and she got cupcakes, and it's a ruler on the back, see, so 3D, and those were from Dollar Tree, um, and then I got these scented stickers, I think also from Dollar Tree, I can't remember, and some sheets of these little tattoos, and a, and a goodie, and more scented stickers, the llama, and more Shopkin things, and then there's my little note to her, and another candy. And then in the um, in the goodie bag, there's little heart-shaped tablets and more more of the stickers and things like that. So that's Haley's. And then my other granddaughter is Courtney, and this is hers. Her holographic thing is donuts. Oh, there you can sort of see a change from chocolate to whatever. And um, there's her initials. And similar bling. And she got the tic-tac-toe. And I made the little bow. It's a um, punch that I have. I mean, not a punch. A um, die cut. And just some gems and things. And she got hearts, but she got the red and pink instead of the, so much of the purple. And I um, put, um, I think, stickles on that heart that was on the paper already. And then she got a shaky also with hearts and stars. She got the hot pink bling. And I stamped the Happy Valentine's Day on both of them. And again, this and her, her um, background papers are different, a little different than the other. And similar thing, she got two pencils also in the bag, and, and really the same types of things. Um, and then I have a few little extra goodies, not a whole lot. Oh, and I forgot um, these heart-shaped paper clips. She got one that's sort of red with gold, and Haley got one that was pink with red. And she got the pink flower, and Haley got the purple one. And here's the back. Courtney's into washi, so I'm giving her two sets of washi. One is more Valentine themed, and the other one's down here behind this piece of candy. Um, she loved the donut one that I put in her mommy's birthday pocket letter, so she's getting donuts and cupcakes and ice cream. <laughs> and then um, I gave her two erasers because they came in a pack of three, and some of the shotgun stickers too and scented stickers, and then I gave her some pieces of paper cutouts that she can use on whatever she wants. 
some extra paper that I either miscut or whatever. Um, and more stickers and tattoos for her. Yeah, that's about it. And uh, of course her little her little bag. So just some little little treats for my girls, my grand girls, and I hope they enjoy them. It was fun making them. I've had the I've had the pockets done for a while. I just didn't do the all the stuff in the back, and I wrote them each a letter. Oh, Courtney's letter is in here, too, somewhere. Or, oh, it's behind this washi, which I messed up. I should have put it up in the corner that had the little letter and their initials, but it's hidden in a different pocket, so she'll have to find it. And that's it. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy. Bye.